Yes. Cool. It's working. All right. Okay. Now, so we might get a few more late students. We never know. Okay. Now, okay, guys. Let's start today. So the case study on page one one eight and one one nine. So uh, this is a case study about a company called Rinovar International. Okay. I just wrote down some uh, basic information here. Uh, their revenue is fourteen billion dollars. Okay, and the products they make are cosmetics, fragrances, skincare. Fragrances, just you know, all types of lovely smelling products like aftershave, etc. And maybe aromatherapy oils, things like that. Uh, it, it, it's uh, operating in the U.S. and overseas markets. Okay, so it's very broad. And there was a recent survey done. Okay. Um, and the survey came up with the fact that the products that they make need to be more varied mm -hmm. and innovative. They have very low sales in South Asia and South America. Mm -hmm. um, they only use exclusive agents for distribution mm -hmm. in overseas markets. Yes. And they, their production is only in the US, mm -hmm. so it's high cost. Mm -hmm. That was from the recent survey. The information is here, but I don't want to spend too much time mm -hmm. re reading that information because there's a lot more things to read, okay? okay. Now, uh, just before we uh, read some of this, okay, I wrote down some of the words, or expressions, that what might come up. Uh, the first one is organic growth, okay? So organic growth is just setting up your own branches and subsidiaries mm -hmm. when you enter a market, okay? It's expensive, but, you know. And the opposite, of course, is inorganic growth, where you just buy other companies or other companies' branches, so takeovers, Take acquisitions, that's inorganic, mm -hmm. okay? okay. Um, first of all, what's the advantage and disadvantage of each type, do you think? So inorganic growth, mm -hmm. what's the advantage? Speed. Uh-huh. Speedy entering to new businesses or... Okay. So much faster than just mm -hmm. taking over, because takeovers can take time, mm -hmm. negotiations, yeah, mm -hmm. okay. So speed is one advantage. Yes. Disadvantage? Disadvantage. Bad valuation. Meaning uh, buying at higher price. Okay. And then near value or uh, incompatible organization. I mean. So you mean for for the organic growth? If I'm are at disadvantage yeah. for for in, in organic. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So that so the uh, inorganic disadvantage is. Uh, <clears throat> trying to adapt, mm -hmm. and if you take over, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. staff turnover and mm -hmm. trying to adapt to new systems, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, so organic growth, the, uh, the main advantage would be speed, as you said, and the disadvantage would be cost. Cost? High cost? Yeah. So having to, to build new yes. bases and our the employee. Yeah, okay. So maybe hire local employees or have, have to send uh, people from your own country. Okay, all right, okay. That's fine, yeah. And inorganic growth? Advantage? Advantage. Advantage. Advantage, Advantage. inorganic growth. Yes, PD. So inorganic is faster? <laughs> yeah, I thought you said the first one. Ah, really? Yeah, the advantage for inorganic growth, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, speedy, speedy um, mm -hmm. entry to new businesses. Uh, or market. So you think inorganic is faster than mm. organic? Okay. Of course, yes. Yeah. Just by several months, yeah. maximum one year. Okay, fair enough. But <laughs> to, to develop new businesses organically, mm -hmm. uh, it takes much uh, longer time, okay. slow. And, yeah. Fair enough, okay. <laughs> So uh, this company, Rinovar, actually, that's one of its its uh, methods, uh, is inorganic growth. Mm -hmm. It likes to buy and take over companies mm -hmm. in other countries. That's one of the things it does, okay? Mm -hmm. That's what we're going to be looking at in a moment. Okay, anyway, uh, another word, dynamic, the adjective dynamic, which of course means exciting and always changing. We have a dynamic uh, working environment or a dynamic team, okay? Prestige, the noun prestige means high class or upmarket. Mm -hmm. This is a prestige brand, a prestige car, mm -hmm. something like that. When you're describing uh, mm -hmm. a thing, you say it's prestige. Mm -hmm. The adjective is prestigious. prestigious. 
So it is prestigious. Okay. Um, autocratic. So autocratic means a person who is very dictatorial, as in like a dictator. They want to control everything. Okay. So some chaebol company uh, CEOs are very autocratic. You could say. Uh, strong man. Strong man, yeah. Or Kim Jong Un is autocratic. So it can be for a company or a country or a team. Some kind of manager who wants to be in control of everything. Okay. And then spectacular means just amazing. Very spectacular, amazing. Zealous, as we that was from our <laughs> chat before. Yeah. Somebody who's extremely religious, uh, a fanatic, like is yeah. ISIS and something like that. They're zealots. Okay, that was just from our chat earlier. Okay, guys. Um, all right. Uh, any questions from any of that? Anybody? Those words are going to come up now in a moment. No. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Now, um, so okay, I just want to look at the bottom of page one one eight. Okay. So I just guess, Ray. Ray, yes. can you just uh, read uh, the last paragraph here? Look at the criteria below. At the very end of the page. Look at the cri cri criteria. Criteria what? below yeah. that renewable international use to select companies that they are thinking of. Acquiring. Acquiring. If acquiring. If you were shelf exclusive of RI, which three criteria? Create, Don't worry about that. Yeah, Don't <laughs> criteria worry about that in the list would you consider to be particularly important and give you priority to? Okay. As I said, don't worry about that part. I just want to read um, the, the information. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Uh, yeah. Continue, right? So, type of business. So. Type of business, we seek a company that has a reading of well established position in its field, mm -hmm. growth potential driven by steady, uh, driven by steady demand, a diverse range of customers and the suppliers, a reputation for high quality, excellent customer relations, a desire to expand internationally or, or has already done so. Done so. Okay. All right. Any, any problems with that, anybody? No, it's okay. Yeah, okay. All right. Keep going, Ray. Financial. Financial. The company should have a record of increasing profits over the previous three years, strong cash flow, turnover between 20 US, uh, 30 million US dollars mm -hmm. and 100 US, uh, a million US dollars. Mm -hmm. Uh, high profit, high profit margins on its products. Okay, yeah, no problem there. Anyway. Okay. And then the management will look for a strong, motivated, experienced, experienced, experienced entrepreneurial. Mm, not a big part. Yeah. Entrepreneurial. Entrepreneurial. <laughs> entrepreneurial means. Can means yeah. Uh, if you're entrepreneurial, it means you like to. Uh, take risks to set up new Challenge. businesses or to succeed. You know, because an entrepreneur is somebody who likes to take risks and set up companies and businesses. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, somebody who likes to take risks to succeed. Entrepreneurial. Okay. And then the ownership, we prepare 100%, but would consider a majority shareholding. Mm -hmm. The location, prefer preferably. preferably in a fast growing developing the developing country but all locations considered. Okay. Alright. Any feedback from that information there? About the type of companies this Renovar will want to take over? This seems to be the perfect target. Well, that's, <laughs> that's their basic criteria. But I'm sure it's difficult to find a perfect match. Yes. Yeah, okay. And just your pronunciation again, entrepreneurial. 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 So your stress is on the uh, uh, you there. You. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, entrepreneurial. Entrepreneurial. Okay, guys? Okay. All right, okay, so just uh, over here on the second page now, okay? So uh, just at the top there, okay? So number one, you work in the corporate strategy department of Renovar International, okay? So uh, what you're going to do is, all right, 
you're going to look at these companies now, these, well, it's, there's four companies. I'm not going to get us to go through all of the companies, okay? Mm -hmm. So uh, maybe uh, we'll choose, actually, you know, I'm, I, we'll, we'll just choose two companies, mm -hmm. okay? And then I'm going to put you in pairs and you can discuss which of the two companies is the best to take over, okay? Yes. All right, so I'm going to get you to choose uh, two of these companies and uh, then, you know, explain why you think there's the one of them is suitable. So discuss the advantage and disadvantage of each, and then discuss why each is suitable. Now, we have Mumbai Herbal Products, yes. mm -hmm. which is uh, located in Mumbai, <coughs> India. Mm -hmm. We have Hondo Beauty Products from mm -hmm. Seoul, Korea. Mm -hmm. Good Earth, uh, which is from Belo Horizonte, Brazil. Mm -hmm. And Sheen Hair Products, which is in Palm Beach, Florida. Mm -hmm. Okay? So what I'm gonna do is, I think we'll choose the Mumbai herbal products, and let's try. Okay, we'll try the Belo Horizonte uh, location, Good Earth. Okay. All right. Okay. So, um, Jibin, can you just read the information from Mumbai herbal products? Mumbai herbal products location: Mumbai, India. Type of business: established. 2004 by two Indian women, a famous model and a film star. Products, hair and skin care, strong passion in bath and shower products. <coughs> dynamic R&D department creating high quality, reliable products for the competitive world market. Customers, high profile clients, e.g. airlines, hotel groups, MSC's top mm -hmm. department stores, financial. Good record of profits in previous three years, but interna international sales have slowed down. Management. Team needs to be strengthened. Its board of directors is dominated by the two founder members. But the members are relatives with little business experience. Company needs more exporting, marketing, and financial expertise from outside, from outside the company to expand <coughs> ownership. <coughs> Owners may not permit 100% ownership by Renova. They will probably want 50-50 share of equity and profits. Additional information, the market for hair and skincare products is growing fast in India, but the company faces a strong competition in world markets. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, any feedback there, guys? 50-50. Mm, is not uh, should for, for our original no, guess. It's all about negotiations, you know. Mm -hmm. You can't find a perfect match any time. Yeah, is that okay with everybody? Yes. Okay. All right, and then um, let's try. Okay, Lucy. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. For good earth, just read good earth there. Okay, good earth location, Belo Horizonte, Brazil. Type of business established. Uh, 1992 products a wide range of mass market products in the hair, skin, and body care segments of the market. Strong position in cosmetics and fragrance, fragrances. Uh, fragrances market. Uses, uses di direct selling, has over 480 sales reps in Latin America, including 265 in Brazil. Brazil is considered a highly eth ethical mm -hmm. company using natural ingredients. Ingredients does not test product <coughs> products on animals. Financial expansion uh, expansion seems already to be slow slowing down. Slow growth in profits in previous three years. Heavy, heavy investment in overseas plants will affect, affect future profits in the short term. Management. The company is run by Gustavo, Gustavo Lopez. Lopez. Gustavo Lopez and his family. Lopez is a strong autocratic, mm -hmm. autocratic CEO. While the younger members are much more Entrepreneurial. Entrepreneurial. Mm -hmm. This is creating great 
great tension in their team. The younger members would like a more decentralized, decentralized, decentralized structure for the company. Yeah, so decentralized, you know, decision making is mm. shared, not mm. done by one no. person. Mm. In the decentralized. Middle. Ownership. Probably the family would want to retain a ma ma majority shareholdings in the company unless Renover made an offer they couldn't turn down. <coughs> Additional information. The market for cosmetics is growing fast in Brazil. Okay. All right. So there we go. Any questions from that company? Anybody? Okay. What's the mean reps? Reps in uh, or good. Four hundred eighty says the reps. Yeah, rep. Uh, representative. representative. Yeah, rep is just a short for representative. Because mm. representative is such a long word for some people. Mm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Anything else? We're yeah. learning a lot of big words today. Yeah. <laughs> do you do an easy or exam or uh, how do you read easy? Uh, so it says, uh, where is the sorry, where is that? Uh, custom, uh, Mumbai. Mumbai. Yeah. Custom, customers. Oh yeah, um, so uh, actually, it's, some people say EG, some people just say, for example, for example. it's, oh. yeah, yeah, it's even for speaking, it's, it's actually EG, you have speaking? personal choice, um. yeah, yeah. Mm. Okay. okay, but that's EG is actually from Latin language. Mm. I think I mentioned it before in the yeah. writing classes. Mm -hmm. Do you remember what the, the two words are? E.g.? I'm sorry. <laughs> no? Exempli gratia. Oh. So it's just Latin from, uh, for, for example. Okay. What, what, like what gratia means? It's uh, exempli... <laughs> 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 it's like You're asking for Latin language. No. <laughs> just means for example in Latin. <laughs> But uh, yeah, that's just one of the many kind of Latin phrases we mm -hmm. use uh, in English, mm -hmm. like that. And NB, that's right, nota yeah. bene, pay attention. Yeah. So yeah, that's another example. Mm -hmm. Or IE. IE. Um, what does IE mean? IE. <laughs> uh, well, in English, it's in, 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 in other words. It's in other words. Yeah. Yeah. It's a different way of saying mm -hmm. something. Yeah. I don't know. IE, yeah. what's two words? I forgot the two words meaning. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, so that's okay for everybody, yeah? Okay, guys, so just with your partner, okay? Just discuss advantage disadvantage of each of those companies mm -hmm. and then decide which you want to take over mm -hmm. with your partner, okay? And then uh, I, I get your two partnerships uh, answers at the end, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, so just have a, have a short conversation there. Uh, 
I, I, I can I can buy it. Oh, you can see the oh, okay, browser. Okay. Uh, browser is good idea. Is the okay. uh, okay. uh, the company is run by Gustavo, which which you think is better. So good or good or I publish. How about you? The reason is I already because the well. Has ten wishes. Essentially, Bath and shower for them today. They also have the like mm -hmm. mm -hmm. the market. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It's a mm -hmm. wide range of products. Mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, this uh, it, it the looks more and yeah, light dynamic light. and innovative. Mm -hmm. but I don't know. Not so, not but it, it, it yeah. has yeah. very strong, strong white, uh, strong, white, so, that's so strong, strong base. Very long, long. Uh, it's been like established like, like, for a long time. Mm -hmm. I mean, good reputation, things like that. Uh, similar, similar, mm -hmm. to similar, similar pre preferences or. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mean it doesn't matter with uh, like the like establishment. Like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter with the establishment. The period of the. Well, it's usually, it's if you're well established, it usually means you've been operating in the market for a few years. But that's the easy part. But yeah, I agree with you because Mumbai has a very dynamic R&D department, so they have a just potential. Very <laughs> Something we don't know just now, <laughs> but they have potential. Okay, financial. The Mumbai company. Mumbai. Mumbai case. The profit in previous the mm -hmm. mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. worse than Mumbai in the is worse than Mumbai in the 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 uh, so we have to consider this in the three years. The next three are management. I think it's neck and neck. <laughs> Very good expression, well done. <laughs> okay, so mm -hmm. the CEO of Mark uh, Gooders is uh, autocratic. Oh, autocratic. <laughs> Yeah. They have uh, an act of presorial in November. Is mm. oh. they do mention the yeah. yes. so that there is tension yeah. just, uh, in the team. But while Mumbai Harbor has a little weak uh, management, mm. yeah. That's not, not, not so flashy or experienced. Mm -hmm. so, okay, so let's just skip. Ownership. 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 For Mumbai, we mm -hmm. they they will accept 50 50 mm -hmm. share, but uh, here, others they are strong in insisting major share only. Majority mm -hmm. share So uh, we we need to offer very good. Uh, mm -hmm. 
initiative or we should make the deal for you can't uh, reject. Yeah. How, uh, what expression do you? Uh, oh yeah, uh, a good expression. Um, you need to make make them an offer they can't refuse. It's a very common expression. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, with uh, adjective or. or uh, could you say uh, um, appealing, maybe, or appealing offer? We can get the, using the natural <laughs> ingredients. <laughs> you want even stronger? It's, it's, no, I mean, it's a little unfamiliar word. Uh, what do you think about the loan anymore? Do you think offer? Uh, they couldn't turn down. <laughs> <laughs> no, that comes from like, if you ever watched the Godfather <laughs> from this, you know Godfather? Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. So the, uh, the main guy so is, is this, uh, afraid, you got to make him an offer he can't refuse. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a very, very common expression. Uh, yeah. that's why, I think that's why they have to say good for. Maybe like this one, this one is really... <laughs> Yeah, so, we prefer 100 percent. I think the uh, yeah, but they were yeah, we'll test the majority yeah, surely in the high court. In most cases, uh, high tier. <laughs> <laughs> we have to negotiate. Yeah, negotiate. Okay. We have but to make some money for that. It seems mm -hmm. to be easier mm -hmm. uh, it's me to, the to persuade the to buy a firm mm -hmm. because they. They, they will probably uh, accept. Uh, they, they will probably want to pick the share. Mm -hmm. But here in others, mm -hmm. one is strong majority share thing. Mm -hmm. But depends on both. Depend, in in both cases, it depends on because uh, they, 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 they are our and sure. negotiation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, and, and with all, all those uh, factors and our criteria, what is your preference? Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> so, so, yeah, this is yeah. the this. evidence mm -hmm. of that. Because it's already not mm -hmm. of so the we, branches. We try to use for our expanding. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's so I think we can have some risk is okay. So we can take this is take some risk. So Yes. Is the is the company using neutral yeah. ignite? Yeah. 
decision so from group A over here uh, yeah. are you having one spokesperson or sharing the sharing. spotlight <laughs> yeah so it starts and then I, I, okay. I, I will support you <laughs> <laughs> okay we we make make a decision we made a decision, uh, we made a decision to to buy uh, to take over yeah to take over a uh, the good earth okay. in yeah. Brazil. Sure. The reason is they have, uh, they have hair skin, hair care segments of bracket. Yes, they, they occupy the hair hair skin segments. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we need to be more varied and innovative products, so we can use these packs and. Yeah. Of course, mm -hmm. and they, they are considered a highly ethical company using natural in ingredients, ingredients, and yeah. it seems like healthy. Seems like mm -hmm. uh, healthy. So we can use these packs by marketing. And <laughs> yeah, so it's especially it has very good sales networks throughout the. Mm -hmm. uh, the area, the whole mm -hmm. Latin America, and, mm -hmm. and it, it would be very helpful for, for us to soft land uh, in, in this new market. Yeah, so yeah, because they're established, so mm -hmm. it wouldn't be as difficult to mm -hmm. enter like that. Yeah. yeah. So soft landing, good, good expression there. <laughs> yeah. Anything else? Any other reason? Uh, we see uh, slight some some risk mm -hmm. in. In uh, in the in the uh, past yeah. investment, yeah. but we, it, it's worth taking risk. Mm. It's worth taking the risk. Mm. Yeah, yeah, taking the risk. Okay. Uh, okay. We, we should need to we we need to negotiate mm. with uh, the CEO, autocratic CEO, mm. and he is a strongly insisting uh, majority shareholding. Yeah. Mm. We need to develop a good offer, which he can't. Refuse. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Nobody can refuse. Yeah. yeah. Or else you can you can uh, maybe employ some of the mm -hmm. mafia <laughs> to pressure him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mafia in Brazil as well. Um. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Okay. Thanks, guys. And uh, the group B over here. Your choice, guys. It's the same, was it? Yes. Yeah. Your choice to go to our thing. Mm -hmm. We, we almost the same with them. Uh, uh, the first we thing, had the same uh, yeah, reasons. Had, yeah, yeah. Same reason. The first thing we first thing thing is <coughs> the good earth has very strong power in the Latin America. Mm -hmm. So uh, based, uh, they can be expanded uh, internationally. They can expand internationally. Yes, yeah. based on the. Latin America market power, mm -hmm. and they also try to uh, invest uh, heavy investment in overseas. They already, it means they uh, already have the plan to expand mm -hmm. to internationally. Expand internationally, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. and management, management side, 
they even even if the CEO is very autocratic, mm -hmm. autocratic, but the younger member are more entrepreneurial. Entrepreneurial. Yes. 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 Just a good balance, you can yeah. balance. Okay, so it's it's uh, in, in harmony. Balance, right? Okay, yeah. all right. Well, that's one way of looking at it, I suppose. Yeah. And the last thing is the shell holding. He said that if, if we or the CEO or decide something, mm -hmm. it may be easy to act in something. To, to act on it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So Operating yeah. quick decisions. Yeah, quick decisions mm -hmm. and quick action. Quick um, uh, to, to implementation. Implementation. implementation, implementation, putting ideas yes, into action. Yeah. Implement. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, any, anything to add, Ray, from that? You're happy to give him all, yes. this, all the spotlight. Yes. Okay, very good. All right, guys, very good. So that's your uh, consensus. Everybody agrees. Yay. Good or okay. number one choice. Has, has anybody visited India or Brazil? No. Or even. Florida? <laughs> uh, no. India, India, Mumbai. Mumbai. Oh, you Mumbai. mean to Mumbai? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, and what's your impression? It was uh, ten, more than ten years ago. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> maybe, maybe ten years. Oh. Uh, at the time, uh, so Mumbai is very big city, but very uh, dirty or so. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, kind of a, it's a common view of India uh, at the moment. Overpopulation. I think it's, India is very soon will take over China population. Yeah. 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 And, and the size difference is amazing. India yeah. and China, you know. So big, big issues there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, and they they also have the caste system as well. Oh, yes. right. the caste uh, system. Right, right. It's like is it like three different classes or something? Five. I think. Or is it five? Is it? Yes. Four. But yeah, it's very, it's very uh, uh, kind of ingrained. It's, yeah. it's, it's, can, it's yeah, yeah, still so in, in this modern time, still yeah. very yeah. inter between inter classes. Yeah, yeah, inter classes. Yeah, even uh, rare and yeah. Different. And there's a lot of the honor killings, things like that. Oh, it's, it's, it's a country that has many issues, unfortunately, but mm -hmm. it's. Part of bricks as well, so it's, it's developing as well, developing mm -hmm. fast. Uh, anyway, okay, guys. Um, any questions before we finish up today? Anything else on the board? Uh, one more time. In, in, six, <laughs> syllables, six syllables. Six syllables. Entrepreneurial. 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 Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Is, is, is this the original French pronunciation? Uh, French word. So yeah, uh, the, the correct expression, uh, the correct pronunciation, you be on entre. But you know, some people say entre. You know, they want to try and change it into English. English lies. <laughs> but coming from Europe, we always say entre. Entrepreneurial. Entrepreneur. Right. Neutrogena. Any questions from anybody from the vocabulary today? No. no? Okay, uh, next class, um, which will actually be Friday. I think we have a class Friday. Mm. Yes. Uh, we'll be looking at the uh, video class. So I'll be playing a, a video, and I'll. If you want to take that handout, I'll give you a handout. Based on the video, um, if you want to just look through it, if you have some free time, but don't forget to bring it to the class. Okay. Okay. All right, pass that. There's two there. Right? So I'll be playing a video about merger survival. Merger. How to survive when your company's merged. So we'll be looking at some questions based on the video, and then at the back, some discussion questions okay. as well. Okay. Uh, we will be looking at that next. Time, okay. Okay. All right, guys. So have a good day. I'll see some of you tomorrow. Thanks for coming, good job. How many is this? I'll take it. Oh yeah, check it. we'll check it here. Right?